Hey, I just want to share our story. Just over a year ago, we gave our daughter, who's behind me, um, a placental stem cell therapy. Um, basically, we gave her her brother's placenta after he was born. And Penny right back there was diagnosed just three months before with something called Rett syndrome. Rett syndrome stole her words from her and a lot of her hand usage. It reduced her muscle tone, made her very autistic-like for a while. Um, but since March of 2016, Penny's been regaining back skills that were made possible by her brother's placenta. Um, I get goosebumps when I think about what she could be without our intervention. We recently went to the RET clinic in Alabama and they told us Penny has one of the worst mutations of Rett syndrome and they didn't know why she was so high functioning and so well off. Um, Penny's really happy. That That's the biggest change. Um, after we first did it, Penny really really got happy and <laughs> um, and there's no therapy that we've done better every day we're thankful that we found out about it when we did and we were already expecting my son and we just have so much hope for Penny's future most people who get a Rett syndrome diagnosis, it's really hard. Um, there's a lot of uncertainties with it, and it's really scary. And we don't feel like that anymore. We have a lot of hopes for her and her future. And I've been sharing our story with as many people as I can. So this is the first time that I'm really putting our face out there with it. Um, I wanna thank Jolie and her mom, Stephanie, for sharing their story with us and helping our little Penny have a fuller and brighter future. Thanks.